I know it's awful windy today, but I thought that I would come up here and show you what's going on. Uh, the US 31W bypass uh, down below me, which I am standing on Woodland Drive, uh, the southbound lane, they have it closed off and all traffic uh, is basically to one lane and they're using the northbound lane. So what it is, they're putting exit ramps in, of course this is at the Dixie Highway side. Uh, looks like it's going to be kind of interesting when they get it done also. Huh. Really cool. Kind of interested how it's going to turn out. And I'll also take you down to the actual construction site where it's going on. Of course you can see it over here. Uh, that's closer towards the construction itself. Well, all right, uh, I'll take you down here in just a couple of minutes. Yeah, it's a warm one, all right. I've already gotten into using the air conditioner. And what I'm doing now is I'm taking you on around the curve. You might say, well, not so much around the curve, but where, it, where I showed you a while ago, just a few moments ago, uh, where they're redoing the bridge. And this is actually where the exit ramps are going in. This is going to be part of a bypass. Uh, the bypass is Dixie Highway. When they get done with it anyway. But this bridge here, it is going to be widened. And of course you see where, they, where they're starting the ramps. Over here, and of course there's part of the bridge right there that they're working on. Kind of cool. And of course we're going through the detour that they got. Kind of snakes on around. And that's where the ramps are going. And all of this you can see where, where it's staked off where it's slated to be widened. That's what all the poles are for and everything. Really going to be nice when I get done with it. I don't know exactly when the project's supposed to be over. But that's what we're looking at. Of course, here in Elizabethtown, or E-Town, there's several construction products of projects going on and another one is Dixie Highway in downtown and I will show you that later if I get a chance and right here I am on the Miracle Mile as it is called and this is the reason that they are planning the bypass huh, likes turning colors now if you can look in the rearview mirror you can see there's quite a lot of traffic back there. Uh, this is actually, I read somewhere, heard somewhere, that this is one of the most dangerous uh, sections of highway in the United States. And I can believe that because when I worked at the Ford dealership, I saw two wrecks a day. Easy. Uh, there'd been sometimes I, I'd seen and heard reports of even more. Uh, but this is, they're actually trying to get a lot of traffic off of this stretch of highway. And they've made it three lanes. It helped a little bit, but it's still not great. All right, now we are turning on to the 31W bypass. All right, there it is. Uh, it's red, and no sign I can turn on red. And that bridge up there is where I was at earlier. And I'm just taking you down to show you the construction that's going on here. Speed limit 45. I don't know if it's federal regulation, but here in Kentucky it is double 
uh, fine for speeding in work zone. Years ago, at one time, there was a sinkhole that had formed. Uh, right there you see this patch of asphalt. And the road fell through. I remember that a long time ago. And like I said earlier, you know, um, exit ramps are coming in down here. They're doing all the earthwork. They've actually cleaned up a whole lot of debris and stuff since I was here last. And I crossed that bridge earlier, if you remember. Kind of a bumpy road. But anyways, I, I thought that I would show you the road construction. Uh, I'll show you some more projects going on here also. Uh, getting ready to jump back over into the southbound lane again. Across the median. Uh, if you remember last summer, I made a video of this part here after they had widened it. Across the across the old shit bumps as I call them. But anyways, that's about it for this video. And I thank you for watching.